Posthumous to Warner. Down the floor it goes. Dotson for the five. Slam a jam on with two hands. Warner. Far side. Dotson to Warner. Drive the lane. Baseline left for the stuff is big Chad Posthumous. And Chad put that one down hard. Six points. Set 10 to shoot, coming left, top of the key. Nine to shoot, eight to shoot, left side, Warner. There's the three, yes. And Warner with 13, more hit state within two. Toward the left hash bar, sideline, Purcell, the run, the weave to Warner. Warner baseline left, the runner from 10, missed everything, but the follow, yes, off the glass by Billy Reader. Billy with three, nine to shoot. High right, Kelly, right angle drive to the baseline, to the goal, left, off the glass and in. Count the bucket, and he's found the possible three-point play for the tie. Warner has it, 23 to shoot, penetrates, pulls up. Oh yeah, five. down low, there's Chad Postumus with a two-hand slam. Left wing, Warner, fakes, drives the angle, lost the handle, flips it up. Oh. Slammed down by Postumus. I don't think he threw it up, but I think he lost it. Penetrates to Kelly, he'll drive the lane to the hole with a scoop and score off the glass of it. Drew Kelly. Here comes Story, bounce high right to Kelly. Six seconds to go. Back to Warner. He'll drive left to the lane. Turn to his right. Shovel up a running shot. It's in with eight ticks left on the clock. Eight tenths of a second. And Angelo Warner has given Moorhead State the 90-88 advantage with eight tenths of a second to play in the second overtime. What a shot off the spin to his right.